Hi guys, welcome back to Tech and Android Geeks. And today in this tutorial, we are gonna see how to hack a pattern or password protected Android phone. See, here is my phone, and I'm just logging it. I'm switching it on back. See, my pattern is a small L right here. That's cool, right? Okay. Now let me show you some other thing. Uh, trying some random, random stuff. Oops, sorry for that. Okay, trying something random. See here it is not opening. Don't get me to be a fool. You'll understand it soon. And now, uh, as I had mentioned already, my pattern is a small L. And right away, see board open. And now this method works finally for the ones who are willing to share their phone with you, but not the pattern or pin of the phone. It works fine with them, and you'll understand that by the end of this tutorial. And uh, for we got some great news out here google's new version android 6.0 is out and it's named it's not out sorry it's not out and the name is out its name is marshmallow marshmallow is the name there's some kind of food stuff food stuff okay now getting back into the tutorial uh, as i have mentioned already um, anything which is offline stores up security measure i mean it might be a password or pattern some other thing else within the disk itself see uh, here android is also an offline stuff so it also stores a password within the disk i mean within the system itself but uh, the android stores its password in the root root files now so we need a root explorer to access them and of course you need a rooted phone uh, see right away clicking it we are just going to browse the location of the files where android stores its pattern or password now right away click on data right here in the root root menu now just head to system head to system in the root in the data file see here it is system let me zoom in just go to this system out here click this now you find some kind of files just leave them all go to gesture.key and password.key see here these are the two important files gesture.key is the place where android stores its uh, i mean gestures i mean they are the patterns which we enter and password.key is the place where it stores the pin or the password we store and so here as i have my gesture i mean the pattern i'm selecting gesture.key select gesture.key if you have a pin or password just select i mean a pin or a password select password.key and just right away click this one go to permissions just select both the permissions don't give it permission to read or to write in this file click ok right away now what we are doing is gesture.key is the place as i have already mentioned it's a place where the android system stores its password and we are denying access to this place to this file just heading back now I'm switching off my phone and switching it on back. Now you see here it is. I have already shown you my pattern is L, but see here we got some magic. We got some magic. See here it is. Just a small click on any of the dots, just right away opens the phone. It may be some random password also, some random pattern. Let me show you once again. Something random. It opens it directly. And do you think changing the uh, changing the pattern might fix the problem? Let me show you a bit quickly. So this tutorial won't take too long. Going to security. Hmm. See here it is. It is pattern. Changing it again. Now confirm save pattern. Here also click anything. I mean it's your wish. Again selecting pattern. Now let this small u be my password. Click continue and again. Do you think this will solve the problem? I'll bet on that. This one, as we have deleted both the permissions, this also won't do anything good for you. It will open by clicking any of the things. Let me show you again if you want. See something random will open it. Now, that's the tutorial, guys. And sorry, as I have, couldn't mention this complete thing. I have just mentioning this video as how to hack a pin or a pattern 
hope, hope you won't find offended with that and of course those who are here to hack the pattern from the beginning itself don't worry we got some four ways to hack a pattern or password in the link in the description below just click on it to see how to hack pattern when you don't know four ways to hack the pattern or password from the link in the description and also thank you guys thanks for watching please feel free to comment like and also please subscribe for more and bye bye guys good luck bye bye